Hello, and I'm Lego Wolf Guy. I'm back with another Ask Lego Wolf Guy. And leave your comments about anything Lego related. From today, Wednesday the 29th to Wednesday the 5th of August 2020. And this is number two. And I've got a lot of questions this time. So let's get stuck into it with the first question. But first, I want to point out that I got this mask for COVID-19 and it's going to bring a bit of colour to my background. Okay, so first question. What's your name? I hope it's pretty obvious by now, but my name is Lego Wolf Guy. Or Wolf Guy, depends what you want to call me. Next question. What is your favourite Lego set? And you can check out my top five favourite Lego sets of all time. But then my pin opinion has changed. But my favourite Lego set is the same one. Just check it out on my channel. Next question. Frog Unicorn says, Hey Lego Wolf Guy, if you could be a Lego Harry Potter minifig, which would it be and why? Well... It depends, like, if you want, like, if you're facing someone, like, in a duel or something, then you would want to be someone more powerful. But then if you just wanted to be a Lego Harry Potter minifigure, then I would probably choose to be. Now, if I wanted to be very wise, then I'll choose Dumbledore. And if I wanted to, like, not get hurt, then I would be Ron, because... Like, Harry and Hermione always get the worst of things, but Ron never really gets hurt that much. But I would like to be, as a Lego Harry Potter minifigure, Greyback, because he has a very big meal every day. Izzy Ford Warren says, Hey Lego Wolf Guy, my question is, if you could design your own Lego set, what would you make and why? Now, I have always wanted to be a Lego designer ever since I started liking Lego. So, I've been thinking on, of a lot of Lego sets I would like to design. So, first I would like to sort of design a Shrieking Shack. And it can be like around about £90, like the Burrow with eight figures. You know, you can have a accurate worm tail as well as like Harry, Ron, Hermione, Snape and Moody. And I have recently been designing my own CMF series where I've been drawing it on a computer which I will hopefully show on the channel one day, hopefully this year. And then if I was going to design like a um, Lego series then I'd probably do like Men in Black or X-Men. But yeah, I would definitely, if I could do a design a Lego set and it would be a shrieking shack. Frog Unicorn says, Hey Lego Wolf Guy, are you going to do any more Lego films? Now if you don't know already, I've done, well, I would say a failed stop motion. I tried doing stop motion, but then it took like, and that was in the time, you know, um, if you've been watching my videos since the start, and you know that, I've been uploading almost every day, but then one week I didn't upload at all because that was because I was trying to take the images, but then some of the images got lost. And and if you want to watch one of mine, then it's called like Star Wars, Marvel, Harry Potter short, something along that line. And what I think I should do is like do a chapter per like stop motion from Harry Potter I've already started doing the first chapter and you know the like second chapter from Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire I did that when I was doing the Marvel Harry Potter Star Wars thingy or whatever it is um, but then it got corroded and all of the images got lost but it takes a very long time to do very little. But I do like doing them, so I will do some very soon. Question from Cardiff. If you could only have one Lego set for the rest of your life, which would you choose and why? 
Now it obviously decides if you are going to like make it like build one piece every day then I'll choose a bigger set like the Hogwarts Castle or the Big Millennium Falcon because they're both the two biggest Harry Potter sets um sorry Lego sets which were ever made but for playability I would probably go for like a spaceship like the Milano or a Hogwarts Castle sort of build and that's all of your questions answered for today I hope I answered them correctly and leave your comments any question about lego down below if you write like ask lego wolf guy or just lego wolf guy or just wolf guy or hi lego wolf guy or something like that and i'll actually give a shout out with your name but if you don't say anything at the beginning then i'm afraid i'm not going to give you a shout out but i will still answer your questions and don't forget, if you subscribe on my channel, then I'll plant a new tree. I'm Lego Sky, and goodbye!